Oh, yes. I mean, listen, we got a tough fight tomorrow night, but we're ready. He's prepared. He's prepared for any and everything that um, his opponent brings to the table tomorrow. What's it like having kind of, I don't want to say a prodigy, that takes away from him, but he did so many kickboxing fights, and then he barely has a lot of pro fights, and he's almost in title contention. What's that like having a fighter like that? I mean, it's a great, it's a blessing, you know what I mean? The key is just to keep him on the right path. You know, keep teaching him, keep working hard, and, and keep it, keep his eye on the prize. So the guy you're in with is a top-ranked fighter. They know a little bit about matchmaking. Yeah. He's like, no, this guy's real tough. Well, you know, we we know that the guy has the experience, you know I mean, which is okay. But, you know, uh, at the end of the day, it's all about who wants him more and who's the better fighter. And your guy's beating, like, the wolf and a bunch of these badass fighters. Yeah. How far away is he on this fight? Is he from title to I mean, hopefully, we you know, right now I just want to focus on this. Just, so, like, talk to me after this yeah, fight, then, after uh, this fight, right, 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 right. Any, any word on Jones? Well, you know, he fought last week, he won. You know, he scored a knockout. So I'm waiting to, you know, we text each other after the fight. So I'm just waiting to hear back from him. Any other guys you got uh, going on at your gym? That, uh, uh, not right. I got a couple more Russian guys. They're going to be fighting next year in January. What's up with you and these Russians? How do you, do you have like a, a Nah, you know, Alex hooked up with Andy Zach and, you know, they took off from there.